He's probably gonna attack again, right? Oh my gosh. Move! No way! I literally have. Oh my! Hold on, I need to see if y'all can hear this. <sighs> Guys, welcome back to a brand new video. My name is Gabe Cruz, also known as Cruzin. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're playing Elden Ring. Now, let me tell you, I've never played a game like Elden Ring ever in my life. Like, I've never played a game as strategic, as hard, or anything like this. Like, this is not my stuff, okay? This is where my dad really specializes in, and he's been begging me to get this game. And I actually like the game, okay? I've seen gameplay, I've seen the music, and like, I'm a big fan of like, instrumentals and stuff like that. But like, my goodness. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, okay. I don't know what to like exactly get, you know? Like I don't, I'm not really like super knowledgeable with these bases. So we got a Vagabond, we got a warrior, we got a hero, which looks more like a caveman to me, a bandit, um, an astrologer, a prophet, a samurai, ooh, a prisoner, which looks like a, a metal alien, a confessor, a wretch. Hmm. Alright, so after a rough uh, little few minutes of like trying to see which character I would go with, um, I definitely think... It's it's going down between warrior and samurai due to the fact that I like warriors and samurais like that's just it and uh, um, I looked at, I looked at both attributes they pretty much seem good on both sides I'm I'm not like I don't even care about the other ones because like I already have my options down I'm gonna go with samurai so let's go samurai all right <clears throat> name. I'm gonna go with Gabriel. Age, young, mature. This age only affects appearance, has no bearing on ability. I mean, I'll stay with young. Detailed appearance, please. All right, so I'm already done. I think I think I'm done with my uh, my character face and whatever. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. Finally. Tell a story. Oh no. So this is our location, the lands between, huh? Now, Queen Marika the Eternal is nowhere to be found. And in the night of the Black Knives, Godwin the Golden was first to perish. Dang. Soon. America's offspring, demigods all, claimed the shards of the Elden Ring. So they all went crazy 
over those shards, I'm guessing. I don't know if I'm getting the story right. The mad taint of their new oh, okay. strength triggered the shattering. I uh, dude, I, I'm really interested in the lore. Like, I really want to get into it. One of the main reasons about the game. Hmm. A war leading to abandonment by the greater will. Hmm. This conflict is even oh, bigger. Rise now, ye tarnished. You talking to me? Ye dead, who yet live. Call of long lost grace. Dude, I'm getting goosebumps. This whole music I'm getting in both my freaking ears is blessing me. Ah, uh, I mean, I know you guys can hear it too, so. More alone. Chief <laughs> of the Badlands. The ever brilliant Gold Mask. Fear. The Deathbed Companion. Are these all Marika's offsprings? Sir Gideon of the all knowing. Oh, my gosh! Wow, dude. Oh, is this it? <laughs> and one other whom Grace would again bless. Am I one of Marika's offsprings? Of no renown. If I'm getting it right. Ooh. To the lands between. Gabriel. Yes. To stand before, before the Elden Ring. Ring. Uh, yes, sir. Wow. And become. The Elden Lord. Alright. Let's see where we're at. Wait a second. This sensitivity is kind of like... Tarnish's wizened finger. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Alright. One thing I know about these games is that there is literally no map. So you have to... You have to know these things yourself. Alright. Guess that button's for crouching. Okay. So how do I how do I run? Doors blocked shut. Am I jumping off of this? I don't know if this. Oh, this is staircase. Never mind. How do I run? Oh, it's gonna be. I think it's gonna tell me as I keep going. Obviously. Oh, there's my arrow. I don't want to waste them. That's how you do that. How do you run, though? I don't want to look at the controller. Should I? I don't know. I'm confident that's going to tell me, right? Yo, whoa, 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 dude. What is that? Am I, yo, what is this? Whoa, whoa, yo, I just started the game, bro. Yo! Whoa. What the freak am I, yo, what is my character doing, bro? Alright, 
I mean, I know this is a, this is probably a tutorial or something. I know they're not chirping with me. Or is it not? I'm confused. I guess it's not. I guess I was. Am I supposed? Was I supposed to die there? I might, I might have to reconsider changing the, um, the camera sensitivity. Oh, what is this? That's a horse. Or an animal of some sort. A magical horse, I guess, right? Don't worry, Torrent. Fortune is on his side. Okay. We found him here, after all. One of his kind is sure to seek the Elden Ring. All right, and we are a tarnished, so. Even if it does violate. The Golden Order. Sounds important. The Golden Order. Okay. So we see a mysterious character who seems to, like, for some reason, think that we're at least certain that we can get into the Elder Ring or, or, you know, have access or something. It's like. They shown they showed some kind of like confidence or belief in us, and by us I mean myself. But you know what I'm saying. The cave of knowledge lies below. Brave tarnish, take the plunge. I didn't know I was gonna take damage for that. Oh, so I was supposed to take damage, because then I used the flask. Okay. Okay, Sights of Grace. Um, resting at a Sight of Grace will restore your HP, FP, and cleanse any status ailments. It will fill... I mean, it will also refill your Sacred Flask. However, most of the enemies you defeat will be revived. You can find Sights of Grace by going where light cover converges. Con uh, converges, sorry. These explanations are acquired in the form of info items that give me assets from the inventory at any time. Alright. Okay. So we can rest at these sites of grace. No, I did not. I'm so used to clicking on X in most of these games. Like, you know, fighting games. Ah, okay. RP is like a heavy attack. Oh, RT. I should have used RT on that. Sorry. Okay. We're learning. We're learning. Guarding. Use an, ar an ornament in your left hand or both hands to guard against incoming attacks. Guarding is especially effective when done with a shield. Guarding consumes star minute, stamina, obviously. If your stamina runs out, your stance will be broken. Obviously. Dodging. You can avoid enemy attacks with a dodge, roll, or backstep. Both of these actions consume stamina. So dodge, roll, and backstep. How do you hit that? Okay. All right, wielding our armaments. Each hand can be equipped with up to three armaments, show, uh, allowing you to toggle between them. Armaments can also be two-handed, making attacks more difficult to repel with shields and boosting effective strength by 50%. So with the right, um, 
sorry, um, with the right side, we can switch right hand armament, obviously left with the left hand armament. Uh, if you press Y plus LB or an RB, you can wield with two hands. Okay, this guy. Whoa! I forgot my stamina. I was like, if you also use a shield most of the time. Actually, you know what? We, sh we sh probably should let him attack, because then if he attacks, I can roll. Yo, can you attack, bro? Okay. Nice. Okay. I know it'll take a little bit to get used to, but we got this. Wow, that was a good move. I like that. Yeah, it's the RB. The RB is like the heavy attack. Well, not really, but what's it? So I'm confused. Which is the critical hit attack? Is it one of those? Nice. Upon dying, you will be revived at the last site of grace. Oh, that you visited. So that's like a checkpoint, most mostly, right? Stakes of America. However, if there's a state, if there's a stake of America near where you died, you can choose to be revived there instead. Okay. Also here. Can I attack this? No. Okay. And this, where am I? Okay. If this is what I think it is, I might die here. Yep. You can perform a counter attack immediately after blocking an enemy attack. Alright. So press RT immediately after blocking an attack. Alright. I was trying to dodge! I was trying to dodge. Nah, let's let's yeah, stay stake of America. We're about to get those runes again. And we're about to beat this dude. Come on, you you in, you're not catching us lacking. Oh, I should have done the counter attack. Oh, bro. Okay. Sorry, we got this. We got this. We got this. He's probably going to attack again, right? Oh, my gosh. Move. No way. I literally have... Bro, come on, dude. Like, I'm not even mad, to be honest. I mean, it's just a learning experience, but come on. Uh, like I said, I've never really played any of these games before, but goodness. Shouldn't be this hard. I mean, we have a Combo combo. We oui. God. See, I was locked in. I was locked in on that. That's why I, I, I actually did he hit me? He didn't hit me at all. Gosh. And we're back at our starting point here. Is this supposed to be something special? No, right? Seems like this is the way.
Okay. What are these? Server tarnish furled finger. Isn't that like the second one? They're not giving these things are, are these things supposed to give give something? Because like I know in, in most of these games they bring stuff inside when you break them. Alright. We're supposed to go here. Wow. Whoa. This is what awaits me. Wow, this is beautiful. Wow. Is that a bad guy? Use your map to check your current position as well as the terrain and surrounding structures. You can update your map with new information by finding map fragments. Uh, you can also use the map freely to place beacons of light. Alright, bet. So let's touch this new grace. Alright. Even now, some sites do grace retain that power. Nice. Hey, my name's Gabe Cruz. Nice to meet you. Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? Uh, yes. The lands between for the Elden Ring? Mm. Yes, indeed. Of course you have. No shame in it. Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. Without guidance, without the strength of runes, and without an invitation to the round table hold, you are fated, it seems, to die in obscurity. Hmm. Okay. Good to know. In every corner of the lands between, you will find fruits and flowers, mushrooms, butterflies, and various other useful materials. These materials can be used for item crafting. Nice. So one thing I'm kind of worried about is the fact that we do not have flasks. So where can I get flasks if I want them? Honestly, I'm just like exploring this randomly. Wow, this is going to take a while. Guys, we're actually going to go ahead and stop it here for today. But what we got to do today was fight our first like, you know, tutorial boss, I'd say. We did our character creation in which, you know, that's just fine. But yeah, I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you guys have any suggestions and tips to make me better or what tips I could use so that I can do better in this game, please feel free to let me know down below. Um, again, this is a new experience for me. And it's a game that I, I, I love, okay? Like, I've seen many people play it, and every single time I'm with my dad, I'll, me and him and I are, like, always listening to the soundtracks and everything. Like, it's amazing. And I've seen him play the game, too. So, like, I have, I have visuals as to, like, what this game is about and stuff like that. But if you guys, have, like I said, if you guys have any tips for me, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, this new experience, and um, would like to see more from this series, comment down below again. You know, hit the like button and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Um, I'm very close to 500 subscribers, and it would mean a lot. Just, you know, a like or comment or even a subscription. So honestly, all up to you. It doesn't matter, you know. A view itself just makes me happy. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video, like I said. And I'll see you guys in the next upload. God bless everyone. Stay safe. And until the next one, peace.